Hi guys, Rafael from European Cigar Squad. Today I'm reviewing CAO Session Robusta 5x52. Uh, and please don't forget about Cigars for Warriors. I'm not sponsored by them. I'm just uh, trying to promote them because all our troops, you know, they, you know what they do for our country. So that's why, uh, so they look in, it's non-profit organization. So they looking for uh, cigars, uh, money, invent, I mean, anything you want, anything you want to send them. So please, cigarsforwarriors.org. Very good looking cigar, very dark cigar, oily wrapper, you know, it's a uh, minimum veins, invisible seams, and uh, it has uh, two bands and it has a triple uh, double cap double cap and aroma of the cigar it's a mm, it's a cocoa and uh, coffee i mean uh, cocoa and yeah, pepper yeah okay look at this i lost first cup <laughs> Mmm, coffee right away. Coffee and pepper, black pepper. Okay, let's do this. A little bit on the snug drawer. Hmm. Okay. Uh, co uh, black pepper, coffee, a little bit of cedar. It's like a um, hickory, yeah. And you know what, finish, finish, it get like a bitter taste. Not bitter coffee, not bitter, yeah, it's like a bitter uh, hemp. That kind of bitterness. And it stay inside my throat, yeah. Cocoa and just pepper, white pepper, not even black. Yeah, no spice. Mm, nice aroma. Look at this. It's burning like chimney. Yeah. Okay. Let me smoke first third of the cigar. See how cigar gonna develop, and I'll let you know. Ten minutes in, burn line a little bit uneven, but only because uh, the way how I light the cigar. So yeah, that's the only way. I'm, yeah, so it's a self-correcting. Medium body cigar. Uh, medium on the flavors. So as soon as you make a puff, you taste coffee, you taste cedar, then you taste that hickory and also it's charred meat flavors yes and um, woody elements you can uh, taste through the whole puff and uh, end of uh, end of palate i got a little bit of uh, like a pepper just a little bit and look at this cigar smoking like chimney like look at this okay retro hell coffee i mean sorry cocoa cedar and cinnamon right now with black pepper in the finish black now so yeah 
smoking perfectly, that bitterness, it's actually disappear. So I'm going to continue to smoke and let you know what, uh, you know, second tour going to bring us. Thirty minutes in, burn line disaster, and I didn't do touch up, but it's self correcting, and now it's I don't know what's going on, but it's uh, not burning well. Still, it doesn't affect the smoke, but what I can tell, it's a medium, medium body cigar. You know, I don't know how long this cigar was in the cigar lounge where I bought it, but here you go. But look at this, how dark it gets. I mean, it's a uh, cellophane get very, very dark. I paid $9 for the cigar. And uh, I had this cigar in my humidor when I bought it another two months. So yeah, but flavors, it's not that bad. It's actually get better. Uh, black pepper, not as strong. Then uh, it's um, those um, coffee. Now coffee, actually, you can tell it's really good, like a coffee. Before it was like a little bit of a mix with the water or I don't know. So coffee, cedar, uh, this uh, charred wood, still there, uh, not charred wood, charred meat, it's still there. Yeah. And the hickory, it's, I taste them, but not often, you know, like maybe every two, three puffs, I feel that. I taste that uh, hickory flavors. And, um, uh, last six, seven minutes ago, I started to actually taste a little bit of leather. Yeah. And Retro Hell, it's basically the same thing. It's a coffee. It's a cedar. Uh, sorry, it's not coffee. It's cocoa. It's a, it's a kind of dry cocoa, cedar, and still uh, cinnamon. Yeah. So with the pepper, actually. So I'm going to continue to smoke. I'm more likely I'm going to do touch up. I'm going to continue to smoke and let you know what's... Uh, uh, second bend gonna show us oops ah shoot I lost my first ash first shoot okay so I and I thought I'm gonna show you what I did touch up it was like a big spice a uh, big spot uh, burn line it's a uh, wavy yeah it's a uh, not uh, razor sharp uh, so what's happening medium body flavors medium plus uh, same flavors, you know, I start to taste less and less that hickory flavors. And um, cedar, it's okay, it's there, not as bold anymore. Coffee, good, strong coffee. And uh, so, cough, uh, the orty flavors start to pick up last 15 minutes ago. And leather, yeah, leather 20 minutes, orty flavors 15. And uh, last probably five, six minutes, I actually start to taste, taste of bread. You know, and um, cigar, it's got creamy texture, but not that creaminess like it's, you know, what I like. But it's good. So, yeah. So, it's very slow burning cigar. It's very slow. So, I'm going to continue to smoke and let you know what uh, last tort is going to bring us. One hour, 25 minutes in. Burn line, you can tell it's even. This is my second ash. Medium plus on the body medium plus on the flavors it's very slow burning cigar so basically same flavors but charred meat hickory came back with more pepper now with more pepper yeah and retro hell i stopped doing it because it's like a last 15 20 minutes phew, spice increase actually it's got red pepper on the retro hell but uh, overall it's good and um, after taste i actually taste uh bitterness from coffee coffee bitterness not uh, not uh, that uh, bitter from hemp like it used to be no actually good one so yeah and basically that's it cigar was uh, creamy not as creamy like i wanted to and so i bought the cigar for nine bucks <laughs> And it's actually good cigar if you're gonna go to cigar lounge. Listen, hour 25 minutes. I can't smoke another 10 minutes. Yeah, so that's way. Flavors, it's okay. Yeah, but um, uh, cigar, not bad. Yeah, but flavors, okay, like I said. So it's been CAO session, Robusta 5x52. Thank you guys for watching. Subscribe to my channel for more reviews and see you guys later. And please don't forget, 
about cigars for warriors cigars for warriors.org thank you